Uh, just get better, get better practice, move on, and we're on to Virginia Tech, so we're just getting ready for them. So, Is that easy to do? Uh, yeah. yeah, I mean, the day goes by, you go to the next day and move on to Virginia Tech prep, and that's all you gotta do, move on. How do you how do you get better? What do you guys have to do to be better this week? Watch film, learn from your mistakes, and just gotta proceed with the, I mean, the season moves on, the weeks move, move by, so you gotta move on from your past mistakes and just get better every week, so that's what we're doing now. Julian, how do you, um, you know, all, all year the goal is to get to the college football playoff national championship. With two losses, that makes it a little bit harder now. With that in mind, you talk about going to the next week and moving on to the next game. What is the goal now for the team to, you know, going forward since the college football playoff might be a little bit harder to get into? Uh, win. Uh, get better every, every day, like I'm saying. Um, pretty much just work on our process and whatever happens, happens. So that's what we're focused on right now. What uh, you, Coach, talked about trying to be more physical in practice, get your physicality back. Is that something you guys really worked on so far this week? Yeah, I mean, I mean that's all uh, the goal of practice every day. Just come out, be physical, and we got to you got to be physical in practice to be able to do the game. So I think that's definitely a point of emphasis we got to work on this week. So I think that's definitely something we're working on. Why do you feel that wasn't there last week? Uh, I'm not sure, but we're on Virginia Tech. Coach talked about if you guys can continue to play well in November and if you can win out in November, that it would be considered you guys would be much happier. What do you guys need to do to do that and to continue moving forward? Uh, take it day by day. It starts with just going, starting today at practice. I mean, you practice each, each and every day and worry about the, the present day, you worry about now. And that's what we're working on right now. So, I mean, just doing, working on our technique and working on the things we need to work on and everything will fall in place. And just not worry about the things that happen in the future. Just work, worry about now. And that's where we're focused on. How would you evaluate your your season personally as a whole? Where do you feel your game's been at this year? And have you kind of played to the level you would want individually this year? I'm really not trying to ask them to answer that question, but I mean, uh, I mean, um, I mean, I'm kind of worried, worried about the team right now. I mean, I'm more focused on that right now. So I mean, just being able to do everything I can to help the team win, and that's what I'm focused on right now. Your brother also also playing at a high level. Do you? Drawing him for advice, uh, you know, if you don't play well, or, or even if you do, just so you can do better and bounce back. Uh, yeah, I mean, we talk after every game, so just being able to, he watches my film and just tells me everything I can work on and just get better for the next play and next week. So just being able to get that feedback from somebody who's at the pro level, just be able to have that mutual relationship with him and just have that have that bond where you can be open and be, be straight up honest with me and just be able to take that into account and be able to get better off that feedback. He's obviously four grades above you, but he's really only, you know, maybe two years older than you. Yeah. Do you guys feel like you're closer than, you guys are closer than maybe your, your grade gap? Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, we talk, we're very close. I mean, I probably talk to him every day and just be able to have that relationship with my brother who's, I mean, I'm pretty much my brother, yeah, it's like, like I'm saying. Just being able to have that relationship, we can just talk about anything and he, he's honest with me and being able to watch his film and see what he's doing to get better and watch, watch my film and tell me what I can do to get better. I think just be, being able to have that bond and just that connection is awesome. So, What do you uh, see from Virginia Tech's offense? What, what I, from Virginia Tech's offense, what makes them a difficult matchup? Uh, I mean, they're I mean, they're a college football team just like everybody else. I mean, everybody put was a challenge for for their, for a team just a new week and being able to work the, work our process, watch film, the game plan, being able to understand their offense and the thing things they do well and be able to capitalize.